how to create a news website in WordPress step by step for beginners. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can take your WordPress website into a basic template to an actual news website. So let's get into it. Now, this is going to be broken down in a few steps. So the first thing is we're going to discuss some plugins and then we're going to set those up to build our site. So let's get into it. Now, as a beginner, you will always, always be starting with templates because going from scratch is going to be way too difficult for someone to manage. Now, to do that, we are going to be using a few plugins. The first thing you can do is click on appearance on the left control panel and you will be able to see, you know, the default theme that you have applied and you can add your own themes as well. So you will see there are multiple different types of themes available, but this really doesn't matter because we're going to be replacing them with a template anyways. Now, the next thing you're going to do is click on plugins on the left side. Once you do that, click on add new plugins. And once you do that, you're going to go ahead and search for Elementor on the top right. Then you're going to click on install now and click on activate on Elementor to be able to activate Elementor. So I already have an account on Elementor, so I'm just going to log on to my Elementor account. But if you don't have one already, make sure to create one with your email address. There's not a lot that you have to change with your Elementor account, so you can just create your account in a few steps. Now, after that, you're going to click on browse from 100 templates all on your own. So you guys can see there are quite a few different templates on Elementor and you have different tags as well. So you can search for the type of templates you are looking for. Let's say we're only looking for free templates or let's say we are just, you know, browsing around. So we can search for news over here or let's say we go into the wireframe simple website portfolio category and you guys can see there are a bunch of different templates you can pick out the one that you like but we're going to head on over back to our dashboard and you will see elementor will be added from here in your post types you want to enable landing pages and click on save on the bottom now once you do that you can open up elementor in a new tab and once you open up elementor you can just log on to your account and you will be able to see a bunch of different options. You can browse through the templates that you have on Elementor because some people find them to be pretty nice because they're not, you know, super difficult. So you could go out ahead and open up your website. So, you know, just take a look at the different options you have available. However, if you are not satisfied with any of the news templates available on Elementor, we're going to add another plugin. Now, for that, we're going to do the same steps. So we're going to go into plugins, add new plugin, and we are going to search for templates. And there are two plugins, starter template, as well as royal templates. Now you're going to install both of these platforms. Both of them are great. I really like starter templates. I've been using that for a while, but royal templates also has some great options. So you can install both of these and you're just going to click on activate on both of these. We're going to allow and continue for royal templates and we're going to just make sure that all our templates are activated so we're just going to look at our installed templates and i'm going to activate starter templates as well so we're going to click on c library on starter templates and you can go into elementor and you will see multiple different types of templates available on starter templates so you can just search for news and you guys can see you have a creative blog this is news oriented blockchain technology tech news so these are the premium templates you have free ones as well creative podcast vlogger i love nature and these can easily be changed the titles can be changed to a news website now, after that, you can go on ahead back to your dashboard if you don't find any of them useful. You can go into Royal Add-ons, and Royal Add-ons also has some amazing templates available. So if you go on ahead and click on their templates kits in the left menu, you can see multiple different templates available. So you will see some premium and free templates, and you can even search over here on the top, just search for news. And once you search for news, you will see some news-oriented templates. So we're just going to search for those. 
news and these are some of the templates so we have the personal blog the magazine blog another personal blog as well as a magazine blog so let's say i preferred the elementor ones so or let's say i preferred the astro ones astro templates so we're going to go into our plugins go into the starter templates and click on c library and with our starter templates we are going to search for maybe magazine and you guys can see there are magazine templates, you know, news templates, but I'm going to go with this one because it's not very, you know, basic. However, it includes everything I would need for a news website. So we're going to click on this template. You can preview this and I'm going to click on skip and I'm going to add some default colors. So let's say we're going to go with blue and black and the default font we're going to be using. So we're going to go with these ones and click on continue, enter your first name, last name, and we're just going to add some basic info click on submit and build my site and now your template is being installed on to your wordpress dashboard so in a couple of seconds our import will be completed it doesn't usually take a lot of time it can take a few minutes so once our template is installed we're going to click on view your website and this is what our website is looking like now once you click on view your website you're going to click on edit with elementor on the top and once you click on edit with elementor this will open up the elementor block editor and you can start converting this into a news website so the first thing that we are going to do is we're going to you know add our basic info so let's say this is the headline of the week and you know whatever it is we can add that over here you know whatever the magazine entails or your blog entails so we're going to add that and below that i'm going to add a read now button so in this i will add read now like this and then below that we have on the side we have the image so whatever is the headline image you can insert that instead so we can go into free images and search for headline or article whatever you might want to call this so let's say this we are looking for models so let's take this image over here click on select and we are going to save and insert over here and now our new image has been added so let's say i also want to resize this a little so you can do that over here like this and once we have our image resized so i'm gonna keep it on the top section i think it's too much on the bottom now below that you have another newsletter section popular categories so we're going to change these categories into our news categories but for now i'm just going to click on update on the bottom left and now i can exit back into my wordpress dashboard so we're going to go on ahead and click on exit and once you do that you can go back ahead into your wordpress dashboard and start building your news categories so we're going to click on leave over here now from here you can click on your pages and in your pages you have your different pages so for our podcast if you have one you can add that but after that in your actual categorizations you are going to go into astro templates which is the template builder we are using and this will show you guys the you know different items that you have incorporated with astro templates and your starter templates that you are using you will also have all of your settings present within as well so if you click on settings you have your performance as well now i'm going to click on all posts over here and click on categories and once i click on categories you can see the categories so we're going to start editing these and let's say this might be latest news and i'm going to click on update and you can delete the pre-existing categories and start building your own so i'm going to go back ahead and let's say i'm just going to build our own categories like this and bulk actions delete and then apply this and now i can click on over here adding my new category so let's say this is going to be hollywood news like this and then maybe i want to add um movie news or movie news or whatever it might be we're building like an entertainment news website so that's why i'm adding these kinds of categories so once you've added your categories you're going to be able to see them on your site you guys can see design latest news podcasts 
and once you add your categories make sure to always add them into your navigation panels to make sure that they are appearing and step by step with these little changes your template can be converted into a news website so i hope you guys found this video helpful if you did make sure to leave a like and subscribe